First, I would like to ask for your permission to use this video for yes. educational purposes on the internet. Yes, you certainly may. Thank you. Now, um, tell me, what were your symptoms before the surgery and how long did you have them? I had my symptoms for at least two years and they became worse and worse and I could hardly walk because I had so much pain in both of my legs. My right leg was the worst. One to ten, how bad was that? Ten, ten or eleven. Oh, mother. <laughs> it was terrible. <laughs> and uh, your daily activities, what could you and what could you not do? Um, well, I could not walk very far. Mm -hmm. I had a hard time doing any cleaning in the house. I had I had a husband to take care of, and it was very hard for me to mm -hmm. do whatever I needed to do for him. Mm -hmm. Now, um, and the surgery was uh, about a month ago, is that yes. correct? Yes, yes. Now, uh, you had this pain for a very long time, and you couldn't walk. We call it claudication, mm -hmm. because you had a stenosis in your spine, meaning a narrowing in the spine. Mm -hmm. And just about a month ago, we did a two-level fusion. We did a OLEF with this new technique. And here are the screws that we put it in. And they are all done with smaller incision. No, we didn't cut the muscle or the bone. And the position of the hardware is excellent. And first of all, um, how are you now? How old am I? Uh, yes. I'm 83. 83. And how is the pain now? I have absolutely no pain. When did the pain go away? The pain was gone when I woke up from surgery. Okay, and how long did you stay in the hospital? Overnight. So just not long ago, I was in a meeting in uh, Las Vegas for Society of Minimal Invasive Spine Surgery, and I showed one of my colleagues these results, and he was a moderator. He told me that uh, what I'm talking about, meaning doing a discectomy, achieving these results, uh, through an 8 millimeter tube is just not possible. What would you say about that? <laughs> I'm living proof it is possible. <laughs> okay, then I will maybe forward this video to him. I would love it. And I have lots of uh, similar, even in six months, a year, two years after the surgery, that this result are as well sustained. So, um, any other comment? Anything? How about you? How's your daily life now? My daily life is better and better. I have to be very careful when I bend or, you know, I try not to. I use uh, something to pick up things, but I, I take care of myself. Okay. I have a lady come and vacuum. That's it. Okay. Well, yeah, and, you know, I think this is a proof that what we call physiologic and anatomical decompression by lifting up the bone works. You don't have to massacre and fill your patients back open to achieve the result, even for stenosis. Obviously, we are careful about who we choose for that, but um, I think this proves that uh, what we are doing is really working. Oh, it does. It does. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you very much for the interview.